Well, the ground floor of a gannet's life is a rather dingy, dark cave. Uh, when I first saw it, my heart sunk rather, and I realised that connecting the two floors was fundamental to delivering the kind of light and movement needed to enable the sense of one team. Um, BP said that light um, is the ultimate source of energy, is one of the things they say, uh, and when that six metre diameter hole appeared in the first floor, letting buckets of light through into the reception, it was kind of one of those wow moments. The spiral stair became a pivotal functional connecting element that sculpturally embodies all those sorts of principles that we spoke of uh, with them in our vision and strategy session. It was a generous in width, uh, six metres wide, so that you could comfortably have a conversation on it while you're passing. and. Uh, and it has a sort of sense of softly flowing organic energy about it. So the visioning and strategy sessions that we did with BP uh, early on highlighted some important aspects which became sort of key inspirations for the space. They wanted a connected, collaborative, authentic space which felt relaxed but approachable. It was a good balance of corporate and social spaces. They wanted a space which had a community feel about it and that was warm and energising. So um, as a spiral stair became the sort of central pivotal point to the space, uh, off that the desks sort of had a, a radial aspect about them. So then we, we've got sort of concentric circles of noise around the stairs from the sort of busy uh, active zones around the centre of the stairs right through to kind of more quiet spaces as you sort of get out uh, out towards the end of the circles. Uh, so the, the desks are arranged in sort of a radial fashion around that which sort of gives them a sense of space and uh, but just and not that sort of chicken coop kind of thing that you're getting in a lot of modern offices.